Squeeze is really tight. Squeeze. It only takes about that long, maybe you know another two seconds beyond that, and I'll be out unconscious, and she'd be trying to lift my feet to put the blood back in my brain. So that's how you know most most chokes work, where you want to use a blood choke. And that's how that particular choke works as a rear naked. Another variation of that is if she reaches around and she grabs her hands like this, and she squeezes right there, and then she pushes her face in the back of my head. That's a very good choke too. That's actually my favorite choke in jujitsu. I don't usually put my hand behind the head. I go here and use my face. But you just make a simple gable grip like a monkey clapping its hands with no thumbs and grab and pull through and push. You have to push against the back of the head with the face so that you're making pressure to close off all that blood. But if you do that, that's a great way to do it. You don't have to remember how to put your hands. You just pull through and push and that can you know easily stop somebody. Next choke I'm gonna show is a guillotine choke. It's a very common one and a good one for a self-defense situation because when somebody attacks you and tries to take you down, you can sink that in 